Okay, we're gonna tour this butter plant. So people ask me all the time, can you do a butter plant? Of course we can. Of course we can. This is a 45 footer. It's an absolutely beautiful color. I love it. It's called Cedar Path. So this is opens up into just a little clean entry room. We have um, some outlets in here. They can do their lab testing or, or eventually maybe um, a bottle washer. And then into the processing room. This is sort of backwards from what we normally do. <clears throat> so we'll start at the end. Yes, the door is open. It is super hot today. So the mini split is down, but it will go back up on the wall uh, once it gets on site. We have a 99 gallon micro dairy designs pasteurizer recorder, the 200 amp electric panel, exhaust fan, cream separator, uh, the paracelic pump on uh, a table on wheels, and then this is the EcoFlex bottler that will be assembled on site. And so it's nice because the table's on wheels so you can kind of push the pump wherever it's needed because the milk going from the pasteurizer to the separator will go into the separator right through the parasaltic pump tubing and come out through the parasaltic pump tubing. And it's not set up now, but on, normally it has these three valves that come off, the milk goes in the middle, and then you have your skim and your cream. And so when they want to bottle milk and cool the pasteurized milk after pasteurization, they have a 10 foot tube cooler here. And so they'll run from the pasteurizer through the tube cooler and then back to the pasteurizer until it's cool enough. And then they'll wheel this little table over and bottle it up. And then once they have their cream and they're ready to make their butter, they'll put it in this carriage machine shop butter churn. Triple sink, hand sink, on demand hot water heater, and filtered air intake. There you have a butter plant.